This news segment from KLRU brought to you by Texas Mutual Insurance. Everybody knows Austin is a techie heaven. And the newest gadget to debut here is the country's first Bitcoin ATM at Handlebar downtown. We got approached by a guy named CK Chen who owns Swift's Attic, which is a restaurant around the corner. He contacted us and said, hey, I don't have space for it. Do you guys want to come and um, have the opportunity to have this ATM at the bar? The machine allows people to walk up and either enroll in Bitcoin on the spot or buy and sell from your pre-existing account. You can also withdraw cash, turn around, and use that cash to buy a beer, a fact that's not lost on the bar owners. The one in, in Canada, it's, it's brought a lot of business, so ideally we get some foot traffic and, you know, get some, get some booze sold and merchandise and stuff like that. The same company has also placed an ATM at Dominican Joe Coffee Shop on South Congress. But as you might have heard, Bitcoin has had a rough couple of months. One of the largest Bitcoin exchanges located in Tokyo went offline. There is no uh, intermediary. There is no Visa or MasterCard mediating between you and the vendor. There is no telephone number that you can dial if something goes wrong and suddenly your Bitcoins have disappeared. All you need is a clever hacker that hacks into your, your wallet and suddenly your fortune in Bitcoin disappears. And just this week, the IRS ruled that when it comes to tax purposes, virtual currency like Bitcoin isn't a currency at all. Rather, it's property which could mean another crippling headache for Bitcoin users. For KLRU, I'm Allison Sanza. This news segment from KLRU was brought to you by Texas Mutual Insurance.